second mistake, year six, unit ten. It's a mystery. Lesson six, writing, pages hundred and twenty-eight to hundred and twenty-nine. Lesson objective, write a play script. Recognize features of a play script. Learning to learn self motivation. Be persistent. Read the play script. Write the parts of the script in the correct places. Early morning in the kitchen in the family home. Music is playing on the radio. The family is getting ready for a trip, but Sam is playing with the car keys. Are you ready, Laura? Here, catch. Throw the keys to Laura. Well done. Stop playing with my keys, Sam. You might lose them. I'm sorry, Mum. What's next that we have? We go for the trip. There are sandwiches and drinks. Ten minutes later, still in the kitchen. Oh no! Where are my keys? Sam, you were playing with them. Where did you put them? I can't remember. I'm sorry, Mum. Looks everywhere for the key. I can't find them anywhere. We'll have to take the bus. I'll call a taxi to take us to the bus station. Read the script again and answer the question. Is this the beginning, middle, or end of the play? How do you know it? The beginning because we are introduced to the characters. How many characters are there? There are three. It's Sam, Mrs. Ball, and Laura. When and where does the scene take place? Early morning in the kitchen. Where are the stage directions? Find and underline them. It's in italics and in brackets. For example, throw keys to Laura. Do you agree? Speech marks in the play. How do you show that someone is speaking? No, their names are placed before the words they say with a semicolon after that. Read the end of the story. Work in pairs to write it as a scene from the play. Remember to include stage directions. The taxi stop in front of the bus station. Why are we stopping here? Asked Mrs. Ball. The taxi driver said there was a police car at the entrance. Then a police officer came over and said, "Good morning. Where are you going?" Mrs. Ball told him the bus left in ten minutes. I'm afraid there's a problem. Explained the police. A thief has escaped as in, in the station. It's close, and we find him. But we may miss the bus," said Mrs. Ball worriedly. You should go by car," said the police officer. "But we can't," explained Mrs. Small impatiently. "My son has lost my car keys. Are they the keys in your pants pocket?" the police officer asked Laura with a smile. "Oh, Laura," said Mrs. Small happily. "Clever panda," said Laura, and she and Sam laughed. Scene two at the bus station. Why are we stopping here? There's a police car at. Mrs. Small, why are we stopping here? There's a police car to the station. At the entrance, police officer. Good morning. Where are you going? The bus leaves in ten minutes. I'm afraid there's a problem. A thief has escaped as in the station. It's closed until we find him. But we may miss the bus. You should go by car. But we can't. My son has lost my car keys. Are they the keys in your pants pocket? Oh, Laura. Clever panda! <laughs> Late morning at the bus station. Learning to learn, self motivation, be persistent. Sometimes a task can seem very difficult to complete. When this happens, it is important to be persistent. This means that you keep trying even when you find something challenging. Did you know that persistence is important than intelligence for success and high grades? Follow these tips the next time you have a difficult task. Take it one step at a time. Keep trying again and again. Be positive and patient. Know when to ask for help. Think about a difficult task you completed recently. What steps did you take to help you finish it? How did you feel when you were unsuccessful? Thanks for watching. Do click like and subscribe for more videos.